Okay, so you guys, hey, I'm here with another makeup tutorial for you all. This tutorial is basically going to be a review on the new BH Cosmetics Weekend Festival Palette. Of course, I recently got this palette from Ulta Beauty, and I definitely love the colors. I absolutely love just the way they were so pigmented. And I was like, I definitely have to give this palette a try. Like, it was so inexpensive. It was like... $18 so I really feel like I really really needed to have it like it's just so pretty so of course let me just go ahead and open the palette for you so you can see these bomb colors so of course this is the palette up close and personal I'm pretty sure you can see the colors they're very pigmented just from looking at them like my favorite color is of course this lime green like I love this lime green it's so pretty I've always been a very big fan of green colors but um also the blue as well um the green is actually called neon i really think that they released this palette more so for coachella, Co for coachella i believe so because i know a lot of people have been coming out with a lot of colors but not only that also because it's the summertime well it's not yet but it's about to come so of course why not but of course you guys if you want to see my crazy look that i'm going to give you guys let's go ahead and get right into it so first things first, we're just going to go ahead with our NYX Milk Jumbo Eye Pencil. Y'all know this is my everyday go-to pencil. I absolutely love this pencil with everything. Like, this is like better than the actual white base itself. So we're just going to go ahead and just put it all over our eyelid. Well, mainly right here on the bottom. So now we're going to go ahead and go into the palette. So first things first, we're going to go ahead and take the BH Cosmetics Take Me To Wait, I mean, sorry. <laughs> Weekend Festival Palette. We're going to go ahead and take the color Swag. Right here is this purple. That's the color that we're going to go ahead and take. And we're going to kind of put it a little bit above our crease and kind of over our eyelid just a little bit. Okay, so after that, we're going to go ahead and with the color um, Dippy, it's this pink color right here. We're just going to go take this color Dippy and we're just going to use this Real Techniques um, Dome Shadow Brush. And what we're going to do is we're going to apply the eyeshadow just right on top of this purple right here. Still creating that same kind of oval domey shape. and take the radiant cover from um new york absolute from absolute new york i'm sorry you guys we're gonna take the concealer i'm gonna take the um shade medium warm as my cut crease um concealer that i'm gonna use um i really really love this concealer you guys like i use it for my eyebrows i use it for my face like this concealer is a bomb eyeshadow base and you don't even have to set it that's how bomb it is i absolutely love this stuff right here you guys so we're just going to go ahead and take it and use it as our cut crease concealer <laughs> now we're going to go in and go ahead and take the shade spirit and we're going to put this right in our inner eye tear duct right here spirit <laughs> Thank you. 
Now we're gonna go ahead and take the shade Ultimate right here, this blue color. Now we're gonna go in and take the shade Wicked right here. It's this purple color right under that blue. <laughs> After that, we're just gonna go in with our NYX Liquid Matte Eyeliner in black. I'm just gonna go ahead and take. After this, I'm gonna go ahead and take my Maybelline 24 Hour Super Stay Foundation in the shade 356 Warm Coconut. Now I'm going to take the Maybelline Age Rewind um, Dark Eraser Concealer and I'm going to use the shade Caramel. 